HMAS Toowoomba is experiencing a British invasion. While no one's safety or security has been compromised, it is interesting to note that of the ship's 192 members, six hail from the United Kingdom, five are veterans of the Royal Navy. It's pretty funny, I mean, we all try not to say in the Royal Navy, we did this, we uh, try and stay pretty circumspect. Uh, but no, it's, uh, it's, it's a good bundle on board, you know, a bit of colonial stuff going on. Given that the English are often, sometimes unfairly, chastised over their unrefined taste buds, these likely lads decided to treat their shipmates to a taste of the old country. All of us came over from England over the last 15, 20 years. So ships war enough, sir, just thought it'd be a good idea for the British to put the food on one night, just for a bit of a rest for the chefs and a perk for the ship's company, really. Mushy peas, fish and chips, pies and toad in the hole were just some of the delights on offer. For dessert, bread and butter pudding and the unfortunately named Spotted Dick. They seem to enjoy it. Uh, they thought it was quite funny and the food was good as well. So I had no complaints from the ship's company, they've been really good about it. The English Dining Night, one of a series of themed events designed to keep spirits high during Toowoomba's involvement in Operation Slipper in the Middle East area of operations. During its 100 plus days at sea, the ship and her crew have taken part in vital maritime security operations, including anti-narcotic and anti-piracy patrols.